y'all it's your girl Sonia welcome back to my channel if you are new here welcome to my family and if you're a returning family member welcome back y'all know I love when y'all come to visit so y'all today we will be doing a review of two Mountain Dew flavors I don't know how new these are I just happen to see them in the people's dollar store that's the yellow one not the green or the red and they're, uh, I hadn't seen them before, so I decided to go ahead and pick them up so that we could give them a try. Okay, y'all? So we're going to be doing that anyway uh, before we get into these Mountain Dews, okay? If you've not subscribed to the channel, I feel like y'all can't see me. If y'all have not subscribed to the channel, what are you waiting for? Go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Make sure you turn on that post notification bell so you'll know anytime I go live or share new videos. Uh thumbs me up y'all make sure you share my video out and leave me comments down below i will be greatly greatly appreciative so y'all happy slay timber day such and such y'all know we never know what day it is anyway like i said i synced these at the people's dollar general the yellow one and i decided to go ahead and grab them because i've never seen them before so i wanted to give them a try um to see what they what they give in so this one is the baja passion fruit punch and this one eel the baja caribbean splash let me see this one is guava flavored and this one is passion fruit flavored i guess that makes sense okay so i don't know which one i want to try first since i have on a purple shirt I think I'm going to try the pink one first. Oh, shit. Let's go on and try this one. Y'all, it's so hot, so my bottle is leaking all over the place, but we're going to go on and get into it. I haven't had guava in such a long time, so I don't even know if I remember what guava tastes like. Smell a little funky. Smell is kind of syrupy, like off-putting. I don't know. It's weird. Anyway, y'all want some? Y'all get y'all a cup, because I know I don't know where y'all mouth being. Get y'all a cup. Y'all get y'all a sweet. I guess that's the guava flavor, the artificially guava flavor, but we'll see. That's cute. Mm. That tastes better than I expected it to taste. You can definitely taste the guava in it. I'm trying to get a napkin, y'all. Hold on. <clears throat> you can definitely taste the guava flavor. It is very, very artificial, though. Um, well, it, I mean, it does say artificially flavor, artificial guava flavor. So yes, you can definitely tell that it's artificial. And I thought <clears throat> it had a bit of an aftertaste. Let me try it again. Mm. It's got a hint of the artificial aftertaste. Um, but it's not so terrible that you it's like it's not tolerable. Like you can definitely tolerate it. Tolerate it. I don't know what's going on with my speech the past few days, but apparently I need to take some speech therapy because I've been tongue tied for the past couple of days and I don't know why. It's beyond me. Anyway, that one is cute. I liked it a lot. So that was the Baja Caribbean Splash with the artificial guava flavor. This one is the passion fruit. Let's see what this one tastes like. Damn, this one smells like a candle or a crayon or something. It kind of, it smells like flavored, ton uh, yeah, it smells like flavored tonic water. I don't know. It's weird. I can't taste it. And it's probably because I got that in my, in my throat. I had to clear my palate a little piece with some water. Let's see. This one is just so 
all over my mouth. I can't really taste this one. I swallowed a little too hard. I almost choked myself, y'all. Excuse me, Lord. This one, the flavor's not very strong. I guess kind of like passion fruit. For me, passion fruit is does not have <clears throat> a really strong flavor. So this one, I don't know. You can't really get a full flavor. <coughs> you can taste the passion fruit, but you can't get like the full flavor of the passion fruit unless that drink is just messing with my palate. I don't know. It could be that one. But this one is not very strong at all. Like this one had a really, excuse me, Lord, strong taste, like a really strong flavor. But this one to me don't. This one, mm-mm. I don't know. Maybe it's because passion fruit just ain't a real strong flavored fruit. Because this one, it's not really, um, it, the flavor is not very strong. Like I said, unless this one is messing with my palate, because this one you can taste a lot of the, um, the flavor in. But this one not. I should have probably tried this one first before I tried this one. Because guava does have a bit of a stronger flavor than passion fruit. So, this one, clearly I like this one better. <coughs> this one for me um, just had more flavor. Um, you could actually taste the guava in it. Even though it was artificially flavored, you can still taste the guava. This one is actually good. Um, is it cute? Mm, no, I don't think neither one of them are cute. This one is definitely good, but I wouldn't say it was cute. Um, this one for me probably is about... I would say like a five only because like you can taste a little bit of the flavor but not really like it's not really there this one i would give a seven um because it's um you can taste the flavor it art although it is artificially flavored both of them are um you can still kind of taste the natural flavor of the guava in this one um so i would give it a seven it's not cute but it's definitely a good drink i would drink this one again I would try this one again only because I think this one might be messing with my palate. So this one, I'm not going to say I won't try again. I would definitely try it again just to see if I could get like a full flavor of the passion fruit because right now I can't. Um, but I would try it again just to see what I thought about it without drinking this one because this one is stronger. So I think it might be messing with my palate a little bit. But anyway, or or maybe not. It might just not be as strong of a flavor i don't know anyway excuse me lord like i said i give this one a five i give that one a seven they're not cute this one is good this one is eh. if you if you hot and you thirsty this one will definitely do it'll do because it's cold and or um yeah it'll go down real easy because it's cold but if you want it for flavor eh, i don't think it, it'll be it but like i said i'm gonna try this one again um, when I go back to the dollar store or to 7-Eleven, I'll see if they got them and try this one again and see. And if I get a different flavor, then I'll let y'all know how I feel about it um, when I taste it again. Okay. Anyway, that's it for this review. Y'all, thank you so much for joining me. Thank you so much for watching my Slay Timber videos. I greatly, greatly appreciate it. Um, thank you for watching this video because, duh, I got to thank y'all for watching this one too. Um, make sure you check out all of the participants in the Slay Timber um, playlist. 
they're all linked down in my description below i also have a playlist built of all the people that are participating in slave timber so if you just want to click on the playlist and watch videos from there that's fine or if you just want to go to the individual pages check out their content if you like them subscribe show them some love that's fine too either way just make sure you check out the slave timber members um for this year also please make sure you keep uh my bestie miss louisiana housewife soulful eats and debo vibes in your prayers and their um yeah, that's it. So I'm going to get up out of here. Again, if you've not subscribed to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Turn on your post notification bell so you'll know anytime I'm over here with the shenanigans showing my ass on the live or uh, dropping new content. Make sure you leave me thumbs up and comments down below. I would greatly, greatly appreciate it. And make sure you tell all your friends and family and coworkers and things to come on over here and subscribe to your girl so they'll know what I'm over here doing, okay? Because I know that they probably need a good laugh and they can come on over here and get that, okay? Anyway, I love y'all. Thank y'all for joining me. I'll see y'all in Slate Timber Day such and such because we never know what day it's going to be, okay? Anyway, I love y'all. Peace. Okay, I'll see my peace.